say what they wouldn't in her hair. <laughs> because what she said about the kind of society we live in and the need for art for all our children, the need for creativity for everybody in our society is something I believe very strongly and very passionately in. Because when our children grow up together, play together, learn together, paint together, act together, play music together, they learn an awful lot more than just those technical skills. They learn an awful lot about each other. So the role of art and creativity in our society is something that's very, very important. And I'll come back to that in a moment. But I want to say, first of all, thank you to all of you for braving what looks a bit like November, but isn't as cold as November. But I've never seen weather like this in August in Brighton before. So I don't know what's going on. I don't know who's caused it, but we're going to find out. And I'm really sorry that um, some of you have had to be out here this evening for the rally. I'm not sure what to do about it, but we can't find halls big enough for our rallies. <laughs> So I want to say thank you also to the Fire Brigade Union because me and this fire tender are very old mates. We first met during the firefighters dispute over the closure of fire stations in London several years ago and uh, I addressed many rallies from this platform always accompanied by Ring of Fire being played. We're not going to play Ring of Fire tonight. <laughs> Oh, we are. <laughs> I thought we'd had enough of Ring of Fire, but apparently not, it's coming back. Uh, and I want to say thank you to them, not just for today, but all the other days. Whenever it's difficult, whenever we need some help in a hurry, the FBU always deliver. Thank you, Fire Brigade.